Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we're going to learn with you how to booty clap. For the record, booty clap doesn't mean that you your booty has to make this sound. Uh, so if you have a little booty like mine, you will not hear the sound. But anyway, it means like your booty cheeks um, moves forward to, toward to each other. So let's practice, let's learn and have fun. Okay, I will show you different variations, how you can get it, how you can understand it. Put your legs wider, lift your booty, relax your abdomen muscle. And now what you should understand that your muscle soft, there is no need to be tense. And imagine that this is your bones and they move around their own axis in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. The one mistake that beginners uh, do every time, they start to uh, move their ankles, fold, don't do that. You can lift your arch a little bit, like uh, make distance between toe and heels a little bit shorter, but don't move your feet. And in and out, in and out. The more amplitude you do with your knees, the more muscles will shake. And all my beginners like to understand to make this parallel between how your arm moves around on axis, the same your legs do. And again, the bigger amplitude you did, the bigger move in your booty cheeks will be. Don't squeeze it. Um, another trick that in booty clap, you don't need to squeeze your butt. It relax, soft, and only big amplitude in your legs. For now, before we move on, uh, I'm going to show you two different ways how I um, uh, explain to my students. First, let's go on the floor. Uh, if you um, kind of intermediate or advanced, you can uh, sit in this position or you can lay on the back and lift your legs. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> the feet are towards the ceiling and don't stretch too much your legs and don't make a tense. Uh, if you don't have flexibility in your legs, you can bend your knees a little bit. And now, imagine that you clean the ceiling with your uh, feet and feel how your muscles are relaxed. And in and out, in and out, in and out. And when we go up, we will do the same, but your feet will not move like here. But here you need to do, uh, to do that to understand how your muscle uh, moves. Mm -hmm. Out, in, out, in, mm, 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 mm. Let's do it a little bit. And I know that now you can feel your abdomen muscle and it's good. Tick, 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 tick. Okay, relax. Now let's go back up and try to do the same, but don't move your feet, of course. We don't do like that. Huh, 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 huh. It is only our first steps. After we, will, after we speed it up, you will see how your booty cheeks uh, works, work. Now, uh, another way how to understand how your muscle shakes here. Bend your knees and try to shake your knees side to side. You see that it's a little bit different. It is not uh, around on axis, but here you can feel how your muscles shaking and do it as fast as you can. So you're going to feel the movement here and now try to stretch your legs slowly. Stretch, 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 stretch. Uh-huh, now I feel the um, part where it's changed, the, where the move changes. Hop, and now my legs move around on axis. 
Again, we here practice how to speed it up the legs. Again, and let's stretch, 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 stretch. But don't make tense in your legs. Now I'm going to show you from my back. Let's try to do it as fast as you can. Start to stretch your legs and change and now they move around on axis. Hop. You're going to feel sore in your calf muscles and maybe in your hamstrings, it's okay. It's a twerk, baby. <laughs> we practice all muscles here. Okay, let's do it again. Fives. And don't forget to arch your booty. Don't make it forward. When you arch your booty, its visual looks mm, a bigger than usual. <laughs> let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You see that it, it can be easy if you a little bit bend on your knees. Uh, because beginners like to stretch them and it's uh, more difficult to relax them and, and make the soft move. That's why you can bend a little bit. And after that, after you practice, uh, you will get it and you will do it in different position. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel because um, on the upcoming episode, I will teach you intermediate advanced uh, ways how to do booty jig. Uh, <laughs> booty clap. Okay, and another way you can help yourself with your arm, uh, step, step a face to the wall and put your arms on the wall and try to do the same. It will help you to fix your upper body and uh, relax it and you will concentrate only on your body and on your legs. This is another tip to understand how to do it. And the last one, girls, don't freeze your knees. If you do like that, you will turn it fast, faster than me, because I'm not uh, mm, do it hard. It's easy for me. That's why don't make a tension in your muscle, in your legs, and don't forget that your uh, knees work in big amplitude. Big amplitude, a lot of uh, shakeable moments here. Small amplitude, very difficult, very tired. I'm sweating and I want to end it fast. But now, practice that. And you can also, how my beginners do, add arms and help this mind-muscle connection. How you do like, mm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. okay? Okay, let's uh, summarize it. So, the first one, legs wilder and don't move an ankle. You can arch a little bit your feet, uh, make distance between toe and heels shorter, but only when you practice slow uh, motion variant. Because when you do it faster, the, uh, the feet uh, don't work. The second, uh, relax your muscle, slowly in and out, make bigger amplitude. Try to practice on the floor with the feet, moving and uh, when you want to speed it up, when you get all these steps, bend your knees, do it faster and stretch step by step and try to do this and you can help with your arms. Now let's, let's what? <laughs> let's do it with music. <laughs> Yeah. 
the back. Yeah. Too big, teach a cat, no tricks, throwing that change. Like, I don't really need the two cents. Truth is, I only really know how I do this. Poof, bitch. Magic always happens when I hide up the proof. Is. Sit it on my face, now that's written on my face. Yeah. I might hit a kitty if I hit it, catch a case. Yeah. Empty out the wallet, be spinning through the safe. Yeah. I'm coming for the ghost, damn it. No, it's like a safe. And there is different way how you can uh, shake your muscle. It's a booty jiggle. I have a lot of different explanation and different variation how to do that for beginners. So you can check this playlist. And see you next episode. Bye.